The victim, Mr. Felix Osifo, was allegedly assassinated in the presence of his children and wife, Mrs. Uwaila Osifo, who are yet to recover from the shock. The chief died at the deceased residence, Mr. Matthew Dalandi, who expressed shock, said he opened the gate for his boss to drive in with his wife and three kids who returned from school in an SUV vehicle, but unknown to him that he was being trailed by gunmen into the car who shot him dead and took away his phones and other valuables. I'm still pushing the gate. So one of them come out. I saw him with gun. So he now me to wait. I'm still pushing because I saw him with gun. The other person come out. So I, he, 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 he tell me again for the second time, say stop. And I stop because that's why I already come out with gun. So I dress, come back. When I dress come back. So the next time I saw him setting like wanted to shoot me. Can't see Madame and the children coming out crying. I saw blood. So I quickly grabbed the small the small baby because that's uh, the uh, glass on the ground where the the back uh, uh, the glass on the back the spread on the ground. So I quick the baby said the girl will not tear her leg because she did not wear a shoe. I grabbed the baby with the baby from my I don't come out. Look, madam, come out. I do not see the motor again. Commenting on the incident, the Edo State Police Public Relations Officer, SP Joe Yamu, who spoke off camera, said the case has been reported at the Lovewood Police Station, located at Sapley Road, Benin City, as investigation has commenced to unravel the mystery surrounding the killer. Wellington, Akodaja, ITV News.